What's up? Mag, la, lag, ma, la, la, la. Right, break it up. Break it up. That's enough of the fighting. Both of you, come to my office immediately. I can't believe the both of you right now. How dare you both fight in the hallway. You both caused a big scene. That's it, Frazzle. Since this is your first offense, you will be let off with a warning. But Oscar, since this is definitely not your first offense, and through the first punch, guess what you are getting? Yeah, yeah, a five-day suspension. No. You crossed the line this time. You are actually getting a Saturday school. What? No. Not a Saturday school. I had plans this weekend. Too bad. You should have thought of that before you decided to start a fight in the hallway. See you on Saturday. Goodbye. Oh my gosh, Oscar. Why would you fight at school? Why? Why, 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 why? Now because of your grouchy actions, you got a Saturday school. That's it. You are grounded until the end of the school year. Go to bed right now. Wow. On Saturday morning. <sighs> Wake up, Oscar. It's time for school. No, Snuffy. It is Saturday. Remember, Saturday school. Ah, man, that's right. Ugh. At school. What the? Elmo? You're the teacher? But you're only three and a half years old. Well, Principal Kermit let me be the teacher because he trusts me more. Unlike you. You have three strikes, lose all of them, and you get sent home. Anyways, let's do math. Oscar, what is X times 10? Your mom. Incorrect. And for talking about my mom, that is one strike, two more and you get sent home. Anyways, now let's do social studies. Oscar, what country did the Native Americans settle in? North Korea. No. And for making a joke out of North Korea, that is another strike. One more and you're out. You know what? Scram. This. School. That's it, Oscar. For throwing the desk across the room. You are kicked out. Go home now. Oh 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 Oscar. How dare you get kicked out of Saturday school? That does it. You are grounded until Michelangelo makes the Sesame Street. What's the name of that song? March 6, 2004, with Viant Voices when it premieres on March 6, 2024. Go to your room now. Why? Waiter. Good afternoon, sir. Oh no, not you again. Would you like to try our special hot dog pizza? No. I just want a small pepperoni pizza, please. Yes, sir. I will be right back with your small pepperoni pizza. Charlie, one small pepperoni pizza. He better not mess it up this time. Here you are, sir. One small pizza. What the heck is this? A teeny tiny pizza slice? Why, yes sir. You asked for a small pizza, right? Ain't it cute? When I asked for a small pizza, I meant a small whole pizza, that's larger than this. But not as large as a medium pizza. Give it to me right now. Yes, sir. Charlie, I need a larger pizza, but not as large than a medium-sized pizza. He better not mess it up this time. Here you go, sir. One whole pizza that's not as large as a medium. Hey, this is a medium-sized pizza. No, sir. It isn't. It's not quite as big as a medium-sized pizza. Well, it is just a little smaller than a medium-sized pizza, but it's still too big. Get me a pizza at half the size of a medium pizza. Yes, sir. Charlie, we've got a picky eater here. Get me a pizza half the size of a medium pizza. 
boy, if that waiter messes up one more time, I'm going to McDonald's. He certainly won't be working there, at least, I hope not. Here you are sir, one pizza half the size of a medium pizza. Are you happy now, sir? May I have a tip? Of course, I'll give you a tip. And you got my order right. Of course. Enjoy. I told him he got my order right. Okay guys, let's all go to McDonald's together. Also, I want you to be on your best behaviors or else you both will be grounded. You get it? Yes, yes Snuffy. Snuffy. We, we get, get it. it. Elmo and friends, are you guys ready? Yes. 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 We're all ready to prepare ourselves. Oh good. Now let's get in the car. When they all got to McDonald's. Hello. Welcome to McDonald's. How may I help you? We, we would, would like, like hamburgers, hamburgers, onion, onion rings, rings, and, and a large, large drinks. drinks. We would like cheeseburgers, french fries, and ice creams. And, and we, we would, would like, like cheeseburgers, cheeseburgers, french fries, french fries and, a milkshake. and a milkshakes. I'm sorry, the milkshake machine is broken. Why don't you have sodas instead? What, what are you, are kidding, you us? kidding us? Oscar and Grangetta, cashier said that the milkshake machine is broken. You can both get something else like sodas, or you can just take your orders. No, no way. way. We want, we the, want milkshakes the milkshakes and that's, and that's final. final. Give us, Give a us milkshake. milkshakes. Right. Right. Freaking. Freaking. Now. Now, Oscar the Grouch and Grungetta, stop yelling. Now everybody is looking at us. You can either get a sodas, or you can get nothing. Then, then how, how about, about this? this? What if you what get, get 2,000 burgers, burgers 3,000 3, French, French fries, fries and 9,000 9, drinks. drinks? That's it. We've had enough of it. Let's go home right now. Well, well you know you what? Know what? If, if you can't, can't get, get us what we want, want then, then we, we will, will destroy, destroy McDonald's. McDonald's. Oscar the Grouch and Grungetta. You better not do it. I better get out of here. Oh my god, not again. Oscar, the Grouch, and Grungetta. How dare you destroy McDonald's? That is so 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 it. Let's go home right freaking now. Stop crying, Oscar and Grungetta. This is your own fault. Stop crying like babies. This is your very own fault. Big Bird, Snuffy, Snuffy and, friends. and friends. Should we go back and, get, go sodas back and get sodas instead? We're so sorry. We're so sorry. Go back? Yeah, yeah. Let's go back to McDonald's. And also, when we get home, you both are going to be so. Grounded. When they get home, we are going to watch the news, and if the news mentioned us, you both will be in so much trouble. Welcome to CNN News. Today news is that grouches destroy McDonald's their fists. Charlie says that they can get sodas instead, but they doesn't want to. 
Here is a person who saw this madness. I saw those grouches and they look familiar to what I was watching on the TV. Wait a minute, they must be Oscar the Grouch and Grinchetta. If you are Elmo and friends, please ground them. Now back to your regularly scheduled program. Oh, 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 Oscar the Grouch and Grinchetta, how dare you destroy at McDonald's? That's it. You are grounded, 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 grounded for Google years. Go to your rooms right now. Oscar, wake up. Big Bird, why there is the siren out there? Oh no. I think I slept, but where I'm going today? You are going to school. No 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 Big Bird, please don't take me to school today. I want to stay home. Too bad Oscar. Today is Wednesday. Now let's go to school. No 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 Please Big Bird, I don't want to go to school. Too bad Oscar, I'm not going to keep you home today. If you don't go to school, I will call the police and bring you to school. Now stop throwing a temper tantrum. Oh look, here comes the school bus. Get on the bus Oscar. Oh no. The bus is here. The the school is going to be boring. Goodbye Big Bird. Goodbye Oscar. Good morning class. My name is Professor Grover. Today we will do some math. Oscar, what is 1 plus 1? Well, I think it's 2. Good job, Oscar. Cookie Monster, what is 5 plus 5? 10. Good job, Cookie Monster. Telly Monster, what is 2 plus 1? 3. Good job. Zoe, what is 3 plus 5? 8. Good job, everyone. You did a good job. Now let's do some story time. Nine hours later. Okay, lunchtime is over. It's now four o'clock. It's getting late. It's almost to be sunset. Now let's go outside. Great. Now it's sunset. It's getting late because he had a very long school hours ago. We will stay after school for the night, but I hope before we get started. Let's go back in the school before it gets dark. Good, now it's nighttime in this school. We will have some snacks before we sleep in the classroom before it's tomorrow. Okay class, it's getting late. It's now nighttime in this school. We're getting tired. Let's go to sleep before tomorrow. Good night everyone. Three thirty a.m. Oscar, wake up. Oh no, Big Bird, why did you wake me up? It's three thirty in the morning. Just let me sleep. I'm very tired. Well, because I was checking on you, because I'm done working. I have to go, Oscar. I'm now going home. Goodbye, Oscar. At nine thirty a.m. Good morning, class. We had a very good sleep last night. And today, we will stay in this school for a very long time, and let's go and visit Mr. Johnson and visit this school. Hello, Professor Grover and Oscar the Grouch and Rosita and Abby Kadabi and Zoe and Elmo and Cookie Monster and Ernie and Bert and Count Von Count and Telly Monster and Baby Bear. I'm Mr. Johnson. I'm a customer at Charlie's Restaurant. G-I-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-
Yes, sir, you always go mad all of the time when I gave you the wrong orders. Maybe you should come and visit this school. Yes, don't say, sir. Peoples don't call me, sir, for the one million time, because I'm a customer at Charlie's restaurant. I always beat up Grover at school, and do you remember when I beat you up with my club? Because I was forbidden for attending the school dance party on the last day of school with Simon Soundman, and this is because I'm Mr. Johnson. I'm a customer at Charlie's restaurant. Because I'm an angry guy, and because this is good, and I always beat up Grover everywhere, and this is now wasting my time. This is going very 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 bad. Now let's go. Mr. Johnson, I'm Big Bird. Today I always take Oscar to school, and this is a great school. Mr. Johnson, you always get mad all day because you are a freak. Hey, Big Bird, don't say that to me like that. I'm Mr. Johnson. I'm a customer at Charlie's restaurant, because I go mad, I'm very very angry, because I beat up Grover because I go mad. Sir, you always go mad all of the time, because we like you sir, because you always go mad, and sir, you can come and visit this school. Yes, waiter, I'm Mr. Johnson, I'm a customer at Charlie's restaurant, because I'm angry, angry, angry customer, because I'm on Sesame Street, and I called people waiter, waiter. And Mr. Johnson, just don't sneak on me. Because you always beat up Grover and you like to talk to me and don't visit my house. Okay, Mr. Johnson? Yes, Oscar. I won't visit your house. I won't. Because I'm a customer at Charlie's restaurant. That's why, Oscar. Because I always beat up Grover in this school. Yes, Mr. Johns. No more going angry in this school because Elmo's getting very, 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 very tired around here. Yes, Elmo. I understand about this. Because I'm Mr. Johnson, and thank you for telling about me guys, because I'm a customer at Charlie's restaurant, and peoples don't call me sir. And Mr. Johnson, you always go mad all the time, because you always sneak on us, and this is getting me tired of this. I don't like Mr. Johnson, because he's mad. Yes Abby the customer is angry, I don't like Mr. Johnson, because he always go mad all of the freaking times, and Mr. Johnson, please don't beat us up. Okay Mr. Johnson. Thank you Big Bird, thank you for telling me, because I'm Mr. Johnson, and I won't beat you all up of the freaking days. We are on Sesame Street, that is Sesame Street, thanks. And sir, when you get home, you will not be going anywhere anymore because you always go mad. Mr. Johnson is a freak. Thank you sir for telling you. And I I, I can't believe you always go mad all the times. I don't like Mr. Johnson. Because he always beats me up, I don't like Mr. Johnson, I don't like Mr. Johnson. Thank you baby bear, I'm a customer at Charlie's restaurant, because I'm a freak, I'm an angry 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 customer, and we are now going to listen some music. That was a great song. I'm very angry. G R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R
That's because I'm an angry customer, because I'm a freak. You are a grouchy freak. Oscar, how dare you call me a grouchy freak? That's it. You're expelled for nine weeks. Get out of this school now. Oscar, how dare you misbehave in school, and you stay in school overnight. That's it. You're grounded for 1 octo decillion 567 septen decillion 809 sex decillion 588 quindecillion 765 quat or decillion 346 tree decillion 267 duo decillion 809 un decillion 876 decillion 978 no nillion 98 octillion 768 septillion 999 quintillion 998 quadrillion 887 trillion 300 27 billion 584 million 379 thousand 657 years now go to your room and never 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 come out again wow Oscar is a bad boy this year. I can't believe Oscar was going crazy all of the times. Oscar throws temper tantrums, but now Oscar is in his room, but now I'm going to work. No, I'm not doing this trash. Yes, you are. Do your math right now. No, screw you. Either you do your math or you will be staying during break until you do your math. What's your choice? I really don't care. Fine then, have it your way. You will be sitting here during break doing your work while everyone else enjoys their break. I'm going to write your name on the board. I honestly give zero nuts. Okay guys, class is dismissed. Everyone except for Oscar the Grouch can enjoy their break. Now you're going to sit here and work on your math. If you at least try and finish it, just maybe. I'll let you go to break. I'm still not going to do my math. Then you will be sitting in detention every break until you finish your math. How about that? Fine. Now I'm going to the teacher's lounge and get a cup of coffee. If you do anything else other than doing your math. Then you will be staying during lunch as well. Now where is his wallet? Yes, I found it. Wow, Professor Grover is rich, but not anymore. Ha 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 Busted. There's no lying now. I have all of the evidence I need. Give me my wallet right now. I'm completely outraged. How did you even get a hold of my wallet? Well it's not my fault you forgot to put it in your pocket. I'm calling the principal and vice principal. Then I'm calling the police. No 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 Hello, Principal Kermit and Vice Principal Miss Piggy. I need you to come in my office immediately. I have a student who I've just caught stealing my wallet. Thank you, see you then. Yes, I need police to come down here to Sesame Street School in my classroom. I just caught a student stealing my wallet. Yeah, okay, thank you, goodbye. You grouch are in serious big trouble. You know that this is going to be more than just a suspension. What happened, sir? I walked into my classroom and I caught this student snooping through my stuff and attempting to steal my wallet. Fortunately for both of us. We caught him. There's over $700 in there. Grouchy, you know larceny is a felony. Which means you are going to jail for a very long time. We already contacted our parents. Just take him away. 
you are expelled for the remainder of the school year. This will be going in your discipline record as well. Put your hands behind your back. I'm taking you to jail. Oscar, I cannot believe you stole Professor Grover's wallet, got arrested, and charged with a felony. When you get home and out of jail, you'll be grounded for five months. There you go, Oscar, all dressed up. Thanks for helping me, boys. But why do we have to go to church today? Well, because it's Sunday. Every Sunday we go to church to praise God. Also, we expect you to be on your best behavior. Okay? Okay. Snuffy. When will church start? In just a few moments, be patient. Snuffy, look. I see Abby Cat Abby. Can I go say hi to her? Sure, but make it quick. Hi Abby Cat Abby. Oh, hi Oscar. Hello Oscar. You came to church today? Yeah, me and my family came. That's wonderful. Are you going to behave this time? I'll try. Oscar. Service is starting. Oh, I need to get back. Later, Abby Cat Abby. Okay, bye. Bye, Oscar. Amen. Good morning, everyone, and happy Sunday. I'm Pastor Davis. It's a great day to be here. It's a great day to praise our Heavenly Father. Let us begin with prayer. Oscar, stand up. We're about to start our prayer. Ugh. Do I have to? Yes. Now get up and be quiet. Okay, big bird. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for waking us up today. We thank you for bringing us all together on this wonderful Sunday. We ask that you forgive us for our sins and lead us not into temptations, and we ask that you keep us away from all harm and danger. Keep all of us safe and help us to be strong and persevere. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hey. Men. Oscar, have you lost your mind? Oscar, how dare you say that? That is very disrespectful and never allowed under any circumstances. Do you want us to get kicked out? No, Snuffy. I'm really sorry. I won't do it again. I promise. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm worried about Oscar. Maybe seeing a psychologist didn't do the trick. Anyways, we are going to let our choir, pianist, and drummer take over. You can remain standing if you'd like. A few songs later. Ugh. I already hate it here. And it's so noisy. Preach for Pastor Davis. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, Mom. Jesus is good. I should have seen this coming. Nice going, Oscar. You just got us kicked out of church. Do you have anything to say for yourself? Not really. Go to your room. You're grounded for three weeks. And you're going to see Dr. Telly again. Don't worry, boys. We'll find another church to go to. Oscar, wake up. It's time to go to school. No, Snuffy. 
I don't want to go to school because Professor Grover gets me in trouble just for a stupid reason. Oscar, get your butt downstairs right this instant, Grouchy. Do you want to make me come over there? No, don't talk to me, you stupid idiot. I will become a teeth guy if you force me to go to school, you stupid garbage. Oscar, don't you dare talk smack me. I am your father. You better not talk smack me again or you're grounded. Please do what I say. Now stop acting like a crybaby. No, you piece of chicken. I will cook you in a Weber to eat for dinner tonight. Now stop telling me what to do, you ugly pork belly roast steak. That's it, Oscar. You're grounded, 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 grounded till Michelangelo graduates from high school. Wow, 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 Thanks to you, Oscar. It's now half past nine in the morning. Now we are going to be late. Oh, 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 Oscar, how dare you be late for school? That's it. You're not having recess today. Oscar, I am going to go to the supermarket to buy some things, and you have to take care of Slimy for me. And be on your best behavior and don't leave the house. Okay? Okay, Big Bird. Oscar, I am going now. Goodbye. Slimy, I am going to take you to my room. I am going to turn off the lights while I go out for a play. Instead of playing in the backyard, I am going to Chicago once again and destroy the John Hancock Center. Wait, I can't go to the airport because my flight is way too expensive. Instead, I am going to teleport with my magic. Come on magic, teleport me to Chicago and take me to the John Hancock Center. Man, I cannot see any cranes around here. Maybe I should use my magic to make it happen. Yay, that worked. Now I am going to destroy the John Hancock Center. Now I am getting on it. I am so done doing this. I am now going to get off it. It's time to go home. Come on, magic. Teleport me home and into my house. A moment later, la 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 Oscar, I am home from the supermarket, and where have you been? I have been going to Chicago. Oscar, what have I told you about leaving the house? Let's watch the news. Three minutes later. Oscar, how dare you destroy the John Hancock Center at Chicago? You hurt it and injured some people. You used a crane. You are grounded till the John Hancock Center gets rebuilt which is in a really long time. Wait. We will send you to Syria. Let's go to the airport. Get your suitcase. Wow. Did you pack your suitcase? Yes, I did. Wah. Good, let's go. Wah. I don't want to go to Syria. Too bad, Oscar. You are going to Syria however you like it or not, and that's what you get for destroying the John Hancock Center. We are here at the airport now. Hello, welcome to the Go Animate City Airport. How may I help you? I will like one ticket to Syria, please. Place your baggage. Goodbye, and enjoy your flight. Attention everybody who is in gate 30. That plane is called 5678.999. It will be going to Syria.
Yay, Oscar is gone. Yay, Oscar is gone. Yay, Oscar is gone. Yay, Oscar is gone. Now he will not cause any trouble and hurt in the family, especially Slimy. Let's get rid of his bed. He will never come back ever. If he comes back, we will beat him up. We will never touch our computers ever again. No, I don't want to be in Syria. I want to be home. This is the worst day ever. No, 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 not Syria. Wah! I can't believe I'm in Syria. This is the worst day in my life. هذا صحيح أوسكاش. أنا عارفك. أنا والدك جديد الآن. لعدت معزلك عن الأرض لمدة ما تانو ستو سبعون عاما. إذا بقل منزلي وزهب للنوم الآن. You will practice about speaking English soon. I still don't like you. Man, I don't like Syria because people speak Arabic and go places. It's so rotten to be in Syria. I wish that I could escape from Syria, and that's why I'm gonna do it right now. <laughs> yes. Woohoo. My escape plan worked. So long rot in Syria. What are you doing here Oscar? You're supposed to be in Syria for your punishment. Well big bird, it's because I escaped from Syria and that country is rotten. You did what? Oh my goodness. I'm very disappointed in new Oscar. How dare you escape from Syria and call Syria rotten? You're supposed to be in Syria because you destroyed the John Hancock Center yesterday, but no. You escape from that country. And calling the country rotten is very disrespectful. That's it Oscar. You just got yourself grounded a lot more. For how long Big Bird? Until Mo On It 2 is released in theaters on November 27, 2024. Now instead of taking you to Syria again, I'm telling you to go to your room until your grounding time is over. Now. Okay Big Bird, whatever you say. Wah. Hello. I'm Yellow Ball from Sesame Street episode 3714, having a ball on Sesame Street. Happy St. Patrick's Day everyone. Since today is St. Patrick's Day, I'm going to visit places all over the world. Would you like to go places all over the world with me? Yes, you do. Great. And I have a perfect idea while we're visiting places all over the world, we can sing along to Collision of Worlds by Brad Paisley and Robbie Williams, from the 2011 Disney and Pixar animated film, Cars 2. Do you want to sing along to Collision of Worlds with me? Yes. Fantastic. Now before we sing along to Collision of Worlds and go places all over the world, I'm gonna turn myself around to the back, here it goes. There. Now I turned myself around to the back, I'm all set. But I can't go places around the world without you, come on everybody, hop in my back. Are you in? Yes. Good. Now zoom into the top part of the ball, just a little bit. Super. Now we're all set to go places all over the world. Let's all sing along to Collision of Worlds by Brad Paisley and Robbie Williams from the Cars 2 film together. Here we go. Music Maestro. At the first sign of the morning light, old glories in the sky, across the pond, it's afternoon and the Union Jack flies high. We're on our first cup of coffee, we're in our third cup of tea, and we can't pretend to live on different planets, you and me. In this collision of worlds. 
watch the new day dawn on a distant shore. In this collision of worlds. Oh, you can't sit this out no more. Abbey Road Route 66 CIA to the MI6 right lane left lane metric Imperial pounds dollars howdy cheerio. That V8 growl to a V12 scream hail to the chief well god save the king cops bobbles Tabasco wasabi pistachio ice cream in this collision of worlds. Well it's too late, you can't stop it now. In this collision of worlds. Yeah, find you a place and just watch it now. Watch it now. Yeah, you're a good old boy. Well, you're a decent bloke. I say it's irony, I say it's a joke. When I look around, I can see. We ain't so different. You and me. Meat and potatoes bangers and mash dollars pounds dosh cash auto bomb to the rising sun the I-10 to the M1. Congress Parliament President the King Petrol you say gasoline now grab your bird and get your girl now it's a small world. Collision of worlds. Watch the new day dawn on a distant shore. In this collision of worlds. No, you can't sit this out more. In this collision of worlds. It's too late and you can't stop it now. In this collision of worlds. Find you a place and watch it now. Watch it now, watch it now. Great job. Thank you so much for visiting places around the world and for singing along to Collision of Worlds by Brad Paisley and Robbie Williams, from the 2011 Disney and Pixar animated film, Cars 2, I couldn't have done it without you. You can zoom out now. And you can get off now. Now I'm gonna turn myself around back to the front, here I go. Wow. That was a lot of fun. I enjoyed places around the world and sang along to Collisions of Worlds with you. Are you having a great time? Yes. Well that's good to hear. I'm having a great time too, but right now... <sighs> I need to take a rest after I rolled over around the world and sang along to Collision of Worlds. I'm so tired. Thanks again for making my St. Patrick's Day so special. Until I see you again. It's time to say goodbye, goodbye everyone and happy St. Patrick's Day. Ugh. You know what? Today is a big bird's birthday, but I can't downstairs because I still grounded. I'm going to flip over tables and ruins his birthday. Happy birthday bird. Thank you Snuffy. Oscar, go back to your room right now. No, I am not going to my room. Instead, I'm going to flip over tables and ruin Big Bird's birthday. Oscar, you better not. Fine, you asked for it. Oh my god, Oscar, how dare you flip over tables. Now my birthday is ruined thanks to you. Shut up, Big Bird. I'm going to punch you in the face.
Oscar, how dare you flip over tables and ruin Big Bird's birthday? And how dare you punch Big Bird in the face? Now you made Big Bird got bleeding thanks to you. That's IT. You are grounded, 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 grounded for life. Go upstairs to bed right now. You are a psychopath. Wow. Elmo, please stop making squeaks. Elmo, we have to practice our little minuet. Elmo, come on, be serious. Okay. Elmo, what are you doing? Elmo's being serious, very serious. Ugh. Elmo, I meant, let's practice. Oh, okay, Miss Prairie Dawn. Elmo's ready to practice. Good. Now, my part is this. Very good, Ms. Prairie Dawn. Thank you. Now, and your part is... Okay. Elmo's ready. Hit good. It. Ahem. The minuet Elmo's in now. Bye. Johann Sebastian Bach. One, two, three. No, 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 no. You do not sing. You play it on the violin. Well, well, Prairie sang it. I know, Elmo, but that was just to show you. Okay. This time Elmo will play la 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 on this violin. Good. Yeah. The minuet in Elmo's G. Elmo's not going to sing it. No, no, Elmo's Elmo. going to play it on this little stringed violin. Yes, by Johann Sebastian Bach. But Elmo is talking out loud, Miss Prairie Dawn. Sorry. One, two, three. <laughs> Oh, Gina's oh, come on, Elmo. We have to do it again. And this time, play faster. 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 Good. Okay. Faster. You got that. Faster. 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 The Minuet in faster. G by Johann faster. Sebastian faster. Bach. Faster. One. Two. Three. <laughs> You played too fast. But, but, but Miss Prairie Dawn just said play faster. No, no, but not too fast. Next time we have to play slower. We have to finish together. Well, well, why didn't you say so? Oh. oh. I thought you knew. Okay, Miss Prairie Dawn. Elma will play slower. Good. The minuet faster, in slower, G faster, slower. by Johann Sebastian, Sebastian Bach. Bach. Right. Ready? I promise that it doesn't get faster, slower, faster, slower. Sure. One. Okay. Two. Two. Three. Three. Yes, ha, ha, we ha, did ha, it. Ha, ha. Yeah, that was yeah, very yeah. good, Elmo. We practiced and we got it right. Yeah, Miss Prairie Dawn. Elmo wants to practice more. More, more, more. Yeah, yeah. you do. Yeah, yeah, Wonderful, yeah. okay. All right. Go ahead, go ahead. The Minuet in G by no, Johann no, no, Seba. No, 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 Miss Prairie Dawn, not that. What? Elmo wants to practice this. <laughs> Oh no! 
I'm leaving. I'm gonna go have lunch. Bye, Miss Prairie Grangetta, tonight is March 21st, 2024, and it's 6 p.m. Guess what movie are we going to see? Muppets Most Wanted. That's right. Muppets Most Wanted the 10th Anniversary. I can't wait. Me too. Oscar and Grangetta, there's something I want to tell you. This is very important. Okay, okay Oscar, Oscarina, what is, what is it? is it? Oscar the Grouch and Grangetta, you both are not going to see the Muppets Most Wanted. Why, Why not? not? Because you both are still grounded. But, but Oscarina, Oscarina Grouch, Grouch, it's, it's the, the 10th anniversary of Muppets, Muppets Most, Most Wanted. Wanted. I don't care. Go to your rooms now. <sighs> our rats, nuts, nuts and fooey. Fine. 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 We'll, we'll go, go to, to our, our rooms, rooms, you turkey. You turkey. Man, I just wanted to watch Muppets Most Wanted 10th Anniversary. But no. Oscarina Grouch gets on grounding me. Me too. What should we do? We, we have, have an, an idea. idea. We're, We're going, going to, to jump out, out the window, window to, to see Muppets, Muppets Most Wanted, Wanted 10th, 10th anniversary, anniversary, anniversary while grounded. While grounded. <laughs> Are you ready, Grungetta? Ready, Oscar. On the count of three, we will jump out of the window to go see Muppets Most Wanted 10th Anniversary. One, One two, two, three, jump. Three, jump. Hey, hey guys. guys. There you are. What do you both want? We, we and, and you guys, guys would, would like, like to see Muppets, Muppets Most Wanted, wanted the, 10th the 10th Anniversary. That's a great idea. What are we waiting for? Let's roll. Woohoo. We. Oui. Yippee. Guys, how about a little traveling music? That's a great idea. We'll all sing a song together. Hit it.
When they arrived at the movie theater. Hello, welcome to the movie theater. How may I help you? We would all like to see Muppets Most Wanted, 10th anniversary please. Okay, give me your tickets. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Hello, welcome to the movie food. How may I help you? We, we would, would like, like candy, candy and, and ice, ice cream. cream. Me and my friends would like popcorn and hot dogs. And me and my good friend Snuffy would like nachos and Diet Coke. Okay, that'll be $40. Here you go, $40. Now, enjoy the movie. That's 40, 40 Sesame Street smiley faces. Ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Oh, sorry about that. When the movie starts. Finally, the movie is starting. This means, I can't wait any much longer. Me too. When the movie is over. Did you hear that? Fozzie Bear said. You can go home now, Ma. The movie is over. Yes. Speaking of going home when the movie is over now, we can go home right now. Yay. Hooray. When Oscar the Grouch... Grangetto and the rest of the Sesame Street got home. Thank you very much for going to the movie theater. You're welcome Oscar the Grouch and Grangetta. Okay guys, let's hang out to our rooms and guest rooms everybody. That was fun. It sure was. Oh, oh no. no. We, we hear my mom, mom coming. coming. We better, we better hide, hide in the, the crate. crate. I wonder where they are. There you are. Where have you been? We, we went, went to, to see Muppets, Muppets Most Wanted 10th anniversary, anniversary at the movie, at the movie theater. theater. Did you jump out the window to see Muppets Most Wanted 10th anniversary while grounded? Tell me the truth right now. Um, 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 Knock it off with the um, um, sense and tell me the truth. Now, all, all right, right, all right, right fine. fine. You caught us red-handed. Red we jumped, we out, jumped of out of the window to see to Muppets, Muppets Most Wanted, wanted 10th, anniversary 10th Anniversary while grounded. While grounded. And, we're, and sorry. we're sorry. We promise we we'll use the door when you are not here next time. Um, Oscar and Grouch, are you okay? Oscar, the Grouch. And, Grinchetta, you, do, not, ever, go, see, Muppets, most, wanted, 10th, anniversary, when, I, said, the, answer, is, no, that does it, you both are so 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 grounded 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 until your groundings time is over, and I will change your rooms into a happy sunshine as fun rooms. And I will put your toys away and you will have all of my stuff. And more. Now get your grouchy butts to your rooms right now. At 9.30 p.m. Shut up. Shut up you spoiled rotten little brats. You deserve IT. Don't ever, ever. Ever be ungrounded again. But Oscar and a grouch. grouch. We, we didn't, didn't mean it to mean jump, it to out, jump the out the window to see Muppets, to see Muppets most, most wanted 10th anniversary. anniversary. We're, so, We're so, 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 so so sorry. Sorry? Sorry? No. Sorry does not work. And you know what? What? I'm going to lock you both with this gigantic key so you both won't get out of here. Now goodbye forever. No. no. Oh, oh, oh. 